and it just seemed this absolutely unachievable feat. Raising over £100,000 in sponsorship, getting all this endless list of kit and qualifications, all of that just seemed completely unfathomable. But with time, as a team, collaboration, thinking about these things step by step, little goals, we did it. You learn a lot about yourself as well on the ocean. You learn, because again, there's nothing to hide behind. You needed the, the mix of skill sets that we all had to, to get across. And um, yeah, it's, it's what, a, what a team can do. That's, that's the big thing that I'll take away. I think the main um, takeaway is how powerful teamwork is. And I think being out there with other people really reminded me of how much we need each other. And, you know, you just sometimes forget and you sometimes think that you can get on and do things on your own. It's not really true. And actually it was really liberating to be away from, you know, social media, to be away from the daily grind, to be away from emails, to be away from the politics. I don't think I'm ever going to be as stressed as I used to be um, before this journey. Um, I think the, the Marling um, encounter really taught me quite a few lessons and it made me see things, uh, kind of prioritise things differently. So how relative problems that used to look really big look comparatively so small now. There was a million and one highs. I loved the experience. Yes, there were some lows, there were some challenging situations, but there was no point I was like, I hate this. It was a huge experience and what a challenge. And to think back to those absolutely sweltering days when you're melting under the sun and there's nowhere to go. Your only shelter is in a cabin which is five to eight degrees hotter than outside anyway. You know, crazy. Who would be in that situation? Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> well, 